This is the Technics SY1010, an analog synthesizer from about 1979. It's very small, it's very compact, it's very light. Here are some of the features it includes. Here's the oscillator. The oscillator pitch knob has quite a big range on it. So we're almost out of the audio range with that one. Thankfully, they have given you a tuning note. This is an extra oscillator provided just to give you an A440. And since this is coarse, they've given you a fine tuning knob. Also, you can use this tuning oscillator as an extra uh, timbre. If you want to. Or you can turn it off. Also, they give you the ability to use the LFO to control the pitch of the oscillator. LFO rate is controlled over here. They give you a light to show you in case you can't see. If you want to use it for vibrato. Okay, then on to the filter. This is the filter all the way open. Here's the filter closing. Here's the resonance opening. Also, you can use the LFO to control the filter cutoff point. It also has keyboard control voltage, which allows the control voltage from the keyboard to open or close the filter. So basically, the lower notes are the filter more closed, and the higher notes are the filter high, more open. Also, you can use the ADSR, or envelope section, to control the filter cutoff point. Or you can use all these in tandem. If that isn't enough for you, you also have the ability to direct the LFO into the voltage controlled amp. Creating tremolo. You also have the ability to turn off how the envelope controls the amp, leaving you with nothing if you're not careful. And then turning the initial gain up gives you just the amp all the way open 
so you can make noises. And that is the Technics SY1010.